Okay, everyone. I'm at the rendezvous point. It's time to rescue Beta and Gaia. Understood, Aloy. We're on our way. Aloy. Where are the others? Not far behind. Egghead here couldn't stand traveling with the pack. Are we all here? Then let's begin. A tunnel. An ancient escape route from the ruins on the island. When I realized it ran all the way across the water, I... I thought it might prove useful to come and go undetected, so I concealed it from the others. Shall we? I wish there was a less pungent way to get way inside the base. Agreed. There's the launch tower. That plane offers a little cover, so the only viable path is through there. There will be specters guarding it, and many more can be deployed from those hangars. All right. Alva, Catalo, get to it. Where are they going? Somewhere important. Erend, you're with me. You guys, take the high ground in case we need cover and fire. Tactically sound, I suppose. What will she do? There's a sensor node nearby. If I hack into it, I should be able to scramble the network and keep you undetected. But not for long. Then we should proceed. One more thing. Open up the channel to beta. Audio only. Aloy. We're here. And we're coming for you. You know what to do, right? As long as you hold up your end. We will. See you soon. Be careful. Let's go. Get to the launch tower as quickly as possible. I'll do my best to conceal our intrusion. Beware, Aloy. Spectres ahead. Company, follow my lead. That's what I do.
up there that might get us through that ridge. Let's climb up to it. in this backpack, metal bricks. Aloy, Alva and I are closing in on the regulator. Keep me posted. It's creepy in here. Don't worry. I had a glider. I guess I'll find another one. There's a lot of dead machines on this island. We killed a great many when we landed here. Their salvage may prove useful to you now. I'm a respecter. Sneak or fight. You choose. It's weak to us.
Tired yet? Yep. Yeah. Ah. Clear those wheels. Well, I'll just leave it here then. Hey, bastards are good sports! We can take this one, Aloy! Keep moving! That Stormbird carcass should get us over the gap. I hate Stormbirds. But I guess, uh, yeah, dead ones, man, you know. Now, you remember the good old days when our only worry was whether Meridian would be destroyed? You know, instead of the whole world? Oh, yeah. Good times. Oh, uh, more Spectres. I'll attack when you do. Of this rock. Hey, here. We're gonna have to climb around this corner. I can see the way forward. Keep moving. Go as fast as we can. You all right? Sort of. How many spectres do Damn the Zeniths it. have? Well, they want to fight at once, that's for sure. Ah! And they thought they'd got me that time. Hit it again! Who's it? Machine! Aloy, hey, I'll bet I are Do it. Throw the regular. A moment, we'll reignite the charges. Alva and Catalo did their job. Now it's Beta's turn. Uh, Aloy? I think we're in trouble. Whatever you plan to do to stop those specters, you better do it now. I'm not doing anything. Beta will. She just needs a little time. Time that we don't have. Come on, Beta. Come on, come on, come on. What is that? I think you got their attention. Very clever. You had Beta inject Hephaestus into the base's printer matrix. Which is faster and more powerful than any cauldron. Now we can crank our machines to its heart's content. to the launch tower before this whole place becomes a war zone.
<clears throat> Your maneuver, as clever as it is, means that Hephaestus has escaped containment. It will no doubt flew back to the Cauldron Network. We grabbed it once, we'll get it again. Or we'll find a way to replicate its functionality, perhaps. The Apollo database. That a big rock might give us a bridge to get up and through. Gotcha. But that's not all the specters are fighting our machines. Ah, that'd have made it nice and easy. Zoe and Baldi are fighting another spectra. I think they can handle it. I grab it if you need it. Grabbed it once, we'll get it again. We'll find a way to replicate its functionality, perhaps. The Apollo database. <laughs> Aloy, in case we don't make it, I just have one recruit. What is it? But a big rock might give us a bridge to get up and through. Gotcha. I guess not all the specters are fighting our machines. I think they can handle it. Jump! Made it through without a fight. To the right, I think. And now to the left. You can get to the launch tower through the hangar up ahead. I'm heading over to join you now. 
The hangar's in bad shape, but I can see the way in. Hurry, Aloy! Another one? By the blood of the ten! Demon! She died on her own terms. That's her fault. Aloy, it's been intense, but Catalo got me to a network node. I'm trying to get in. Keep at it. We're almost to the tower. been causing all the fuss. Matilda's little pet. Silence. Zenith inbound. Can we drop their shields, please? I'm powering it up. Stay still. This is pointless. You can't hurt us. Face it, your worms that ooze to the cracks into our basin. Silence? One moment more. But I might just spare you if you give up Tilda. I think it's safe to say she's forfeited her share of our operation. Permanently. Ah, uh, there. No? Nothing. Fine. All right, people. Light them up! Are we supposed to be scared? Gerard. 
hard escape. It won't take long before he preps the shuttle for launch. Then he'll be able to take Beta and Gaia into orbit and onto the Odyssey beyond our reach. We gotta go through there? I fail to see another option. Then we'll carve a path. Ready? Get to the top of the tower and free Beta. Hey, like what? Time machine, Phil. Apologies for that. We're okay as long as all the hurries. I'm almost into the network. Just do the best you can. An elevator. Promising. Miscalculated that landing. Gotta get to the top of the tower and free Beta. Hey, like what? Time machine, Phil. Apologies for that. We're okay as long as all the hurries. I'm almost into the network. Just do the best you can. Trust me, you're gonna wish you had one.
see, little mouse? Felt that, didn't ya? <laughs> Whoa! I can't let him catch me. Not much about your shield, are ya? Come on. Okay, that's Just 
to hurt. <laughs> now we're having fun, right? You okay? I will be. In time. Go. Rescue your sister. I'll regroup with the others and make sure they're all right. restricted its access to the top. You'll have to climb from there. I have to go. I almost have him. Karen? Is everyone all right down there? Uh, mostly. We're cleaning up the last few spectres. What about the Zenas? Dead, I think. Izo told me you got Eric. Good work. Yeah. Thanks. I guess only Tilda and Gerard are left then. Aloy, you there? Listen, I got into the network, but only for a minute before I was shut out. I found a bunch of flight plans and trajectories, as if the Zeniths were planning to leave Earth. Doesn't make any sense. I know, but there's more. The files I found have a lot of references to something called Nemesis. Whatever it is, the Zeniths are afraid of it. Alba? Alba! What's going on here? Maybe Beta can help me figure it out. Are you okay? Look, I, I know you've been through a lot, but you have to help me access the Zenith network. I need to see their files, anything referring to the word Nemesis. Okay. O over there. The systems are down all over the base. I should be able to take advantage of... Yes, Nemesis. Here. There's something in deep space. It's following the Zenith to Earth. Look. Escape vectors. Alva tried to warn me about this. The Zeniths aren't planning to stay here. It's a machine of some kind. O or a swarm of them. The energy readings are... astronomical. Aloy, hey, I don't think a natural disaster destroyed the Zenith colony on Sirius. This thing did. 
Earth isn't a new home for them. It's a way station. They're on the run. I see you've been busy. And you've been lying. Nemesis, what is it? It is us. The minds of Far Zenith. Or failed copies of them, anyway. Back on Sirius, some of my peers weren't satisfied with physical immortality. They wanted digital transcendence. A way to upload their minds into any form, organic or mechanical. Nemesis was a failed experiment to that effect. Abandoned, but never erased. An immense database of our memories, emotions, and prejudices left to fester. And it destroyed your colony? We didn't realize it had gained sentience until it broke containment. It had everything it needed from our memories. Security protocols, system specs, override codes. It hacked everything before we knew what hit us. Then it took over our printing facilities, allowing it to gain any machine form it needed to wipe us out. But why? Imagine being trapped alone for decades with only the twisted echoes of megalomaniacs for company. It hates us for abandoning it to that prison. And now that it's free, it will do anything to destroy us. Including denying us a safe harbor on Earth. The extinction signal that woke Hades. You didn't send it. Nemesis did. Finally, you understand. And when that failed, it launched from Sirius to finish the job itself. Which is why we must flee to a random planet circling a random star somewhere it can never find us. With Gaia, so you can build yourself a new world. That's the plan. Even now. Earth is finished, Aloy. Nemesis will scour it of life to deny its creators a viable home. But Elizabeth's dream won't die. You'll come with me to the stars. And with Gaia, we'll create a new world together where that monstrosity could never find us. What? No. I loved Elizabeth more than you could ever know. And I let her stay behind to die with the rest of humanity. A mistake I have regretted for a thousand years. Now she stands before me again. Not some inferior copy, but her best possible self. So I'm not asking. You're coming with me. It may seem harsh now, but you'll forgive me in a few centuries. You can't force me, Tilda. Your shield is gone. I have something better. Spectre Prime. To me. Take cover! Get to the door! Submit, Aloy. You can't. 